fun, Mackers. Oh, mate, could, have, could not be having any more fun, I reckon. I'll give you a compliment. Those new specs you're wearing, they're looking pretty good. You reckon? Yeah, I'm hoping the ladies will like them, but, you know... They're a comfy fit, you know? <laughs> what What more could you want in a pair of specs? I reckon they fit they look your... They polarised. They fit your big head better than mine, though, I reckon. Oh, my head's pretty small. <laughs> yeah, not compared to my big box head. But, um... No, we're slowly getting there, aren't we? Yeah, it's been a few weeks, but... Harry's been hanging out with his miso too much, no, so... No, 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 do not believe that. That is, that is a big load of... I not, shouldn't be saying it, but you know what I was going to say. This bloke, I haven't even seen him in, I reckon, two weeks. He's been, oh, he's he's been tied with his miso the whole time up in the high country. There. Full driving, have a look at me, pretty boy. <laughs> I've been stuck down here in the slums, working on the boat, oh, studying yeah. for school. Oh, yeah. He's living the high life, the nice flashy life, and we're doing all of it for yeah. him. Yeah, I just rock up and look good. Yeah, that's it, mate. But no, we're getting there. We've finally welded the whole keel on. So last time you saw us, we were doing the leak test, so... That's something, it looks pretty nice now. I've got the big curve at the front, so she's starting to look pretty schmick, isn't she? Oh yeah, it's looking good. We've, we've just finished sanding one half of the boat, but we don't have to sand it out, but we're doing it just so it looks flash. So we just got to knock a few hours at this side, and then, yeah, we've got a few more little touch-ups to make, so about you know, three or four hours of work, and then when you get back from your luxurious holiday in New Zealand. Oh, here we go, now you're trying to put it all on me, aren't you? Eh? Yeah, then we can flip the boat. Yeah, um, which it. is another exciting thing and put it on that smick looking trailer that's been sitting there for a few months doing nothing We'll put a boat on it and then we just yeah, that's when it's gonna really start looking like a boat Yeah, I think flipping it over this way was one thing, but I think flipping it back over is probably and putting bigger. it on the trailer. It's yeah, that's massive. it And it, it's gonna feel weird because that was the last time we saw the inside of the boat Yeah, I don't know. it's just been like this ago. for a while. So we've kind of gotten used to it So it'll be another big project, but um, yeah, just another step in there. You yeah know? I just want to get that big yammy on the back. Well, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not looking forward to that, eh? Yeah, that, all that the is fancy, a beast. All the big sanders that's going in it, all the fancy, all the, you know, no, I don't even know how to describe it, it's that good. Just all the fancy gear yeah, in it, mate, it. all the bling, you know, we want it to look good. As much as, she, as much as she'll be a beast, we want it to look pretty as well, so. Yeah, exactly. Well, I reckon we get cracking on the other side for a little bit and see how much we can get done. Yeah, I reckon so, mate. Let's get into it. All right, so as you can see, we've got the nice pretty keel here, and as you can probably see, we've got this nice sanded side here. It looks a lot more prettier than the side bends on. Yeah, all the sweat marks and all the other things, but we'll eventually sand this side in the next few days. Yeah, that's it. So when you have a look at this, what we've done here, is we've got the keel, and we've it doesn't go all the way to the back of the boat. We've probably got 500 mil, because you don't want cavitation. So that's the main main reason why you have it here. We've got it nicely sanded off here, though, looking all flash, you know. You want her to look good as well as she's going to run, so... That's it. Well, taking all the little steps, yeah. you know. Don't want to miss anything. Don't nah, want to take any shortcuts. What do you reckon? Hop to the front of the boat and show the viewers what we've done? Yeah, I think so. Let's go to the front. So, at the front of the boat, it doesn't look like we've done much work, but it's those little details that count. What do you reckon, Harry? Yeah, that's for sure, mate. Well, we've got the reverse chine here. It's looking pretty splash, but we've just sanded the, the welds off here, so just so it has that little bit nicer look. Basically, the reverse chine, what it does is it creates stability, but also when you are going through chop, it spits out that spray, so you're not getting wet on the inside of the boat. On the keel, we've also cut it about 100 mil in, and then slotted it in as well. So it just has that really nice finish, welded out those welds again, so it looks pretty flash and it's meant to be there. But it's looking, it's getting there. Yeah, well we've, 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 made, we've done all these extra bits because you know, we want, a, we want a beast of a boat, but we want one that will get the girls on board. Oh, we? stop it. Taking this out in summer, mate, you want to have a good looking boat. They're not going to want to look at it and think, that's just a big, big tinny. Yeah. They want to say, say oh, look at that boat, let's get on there. Yeah, so, with that big you know, white uh, yummy hanging off the back of it. Everything happens for a reason. Some reasons we don't tell our parents, but you know, <laughs> this is what you got to do. But nah, it'll be looking... It's gonna look super flash once we get everything done, and it's just those little attention to detail, you know, that can separate your yeah. boat from the rest. Yeah, Especially like, if it's your boat, you wanna be proud of what you've done. Yeah, exactly. It's gonna be a bit of a beast offshore, mm -hmm. and even kicking around in the boat, it's gonna be a big boat, but. Yeah, for sure, so. Yeah. So, yeah, no, nah, but that's pretty much what we've been up to with year 12 and stuff. It's just kind of been a bit of a pain, but. Harry's you know, been with all the Sheilas. Oh, here we go. Hasn't had time to film, I'm getting over it, but. 
That's all right. We're 18 year old, so. That's it. No, this is just it's a bit of a busy moment in our life trying to get through school. Yeah, but once we're out through the other side, yeah. then it's go time. But that's it. You know, we're just slowly getting through it, doing what we can. But at the end of the day, you know, as long as we're still getting stuff done, then that's it. You can't go wrong. Well, the so. sanding's looking good, eh? Yeah, that's right. Looks so, heaps better. So we thought we'd just give you guys a little update video because we haven't really posted for a while. Been a bit stuck up. Been with his girlfriend, me with school, as I said earlier. Harry with the blokes. Um, <laughs> but um, but yeah, nah. So hopefully, once we start, we start moving because we're not really going to film most of our sanding. It's pretty boring, isn't it? Yeah. Well. So, we're that so, one step closer to flipping this big vessel, so hopefully in the next month or two, that's when it all happens. Yeah, that'll be the big video to watch out for, so get ready for that one. Uh, but yeah, we appreciate you guys watching, and you know, if anything happens, we'll keep you guys updated for sure. But uh, this is pretty much just what we've been doing, and uh, we hope to see you guys in the next one, and hopefully uh, something big will be happening. Sounds good. Thanks, right. guys. See you guys.